Hi, this is Sharon at FitInFun.com. I'm talking about my um, learning curve on YouTube, and this video is only about sound issues. Um, first of all, I never have thought about sound. I have a, um, I avoid it. I don't, I don't like loud noises, but, um, and I do definitely stay away from it. I'm not someone to listen to the radio in the car. Like if I'm driving, I need to be thinking about whatever, whatever Californian guy is about to hit me, type of thing. Um, and I happen to know from, you're probably gasping, because almost everyone I know cannot believe that I never have the radio in the car, but I never do. I'm, I use my driving time to think, and I try to be aware. And listening to music doesn't help me. Um, the only time I ever will listen to music is, say, on a long drive when you're on the highway and you're, everything's all settled, then I would put music on. But most of the time, when I'm driving around town, I'm writing in my head, so I don't have music. Um, what I find with the sound in the videos is that there's two issues. There's the ambient sound, which is the um, machine motors that are going on. And little did I know how many I have in this house, man. But I've been unplugging stuff like crazy and hiding it and throwing <laughs> pillows on things. I mean, it's just ridiculous what I've been doing. And I need to really um, do some research on the Internet to find out more about blocking sound because... Um, it's amazing how much there is. Just amazing. Um, one example is I cannot, I can't film very well outside if it's any kind of wind because the wind, you know, makes a problem. Well, same thing at the beach, same thing at um, the bay. There's just different places where it's never quiet. So I really have to keep that in mind and I have a lot of thinking about that. The second noise would be an intrusive noise. People, planes, cars, skateboards, anything that just goes by outside my house that I, um, you know, that's picked up by this sound. And what it turns out is that the cameras pick up way more than you are bothered by it when you hear it. So every once in a while, it hasn't happened a lot, but sometimes I do a video and some point in the middle, something starts happening outside. And um, one time a guy was mowing the lawn, like, four houses away and across the street so all of a sudden the whole video was bad but when it happened I didn't notice it I wasn't paying attention that was an earlier video and that was one of the times I kind of woke up about it um, so the, the things that I do to avoid the intrusive noise is right now I'm sitting in my closet hallway area and um, it's the middle of the house and the quietest place so I can get um, deadening sound in the day pretty much. Um, if I'm filming at night I can film over by my computer um, but it is impossible to do that during the day. I've come to that conclusion. Unless I'm gonna maybe get lucky and really need something I have to do, I'm saving those for later at night or early in the morning when my neighbors are still in bed because just the action of them walking back and forth in my hallway out in front of my building or my apartment starting their cars, just saying hi to the neighbors, all that kind of stuff gets picked up in these videos. So I really need to um, make sure that I'm doing these at a low uh, volume of activity time, which, you know, obviously runs from about 10 o'clock at night until, uh, let's say, 4 in the morning. And since I keep odd hours, that works out okay for me. So I'm really excited about this whole sound thing, and I know I'm going to improve. Um, the final thing is my voice itself. Um, half the time I sound like the voice of doom, and the other half the time I sound like I'm about to die with some kind of lung infection. And I had no idea I had this post-nasal drip. I do smoke sometimes like five or seven cigarettes a day, and more in a stressful time and less when I'm not. Like when I'm working, I don't smoke as much. But um, I'm wondering and thinking maybe that's creating that problem. Or am I actually sick? Like, is there something I don't know about? And I've started to realize, well, I am congested all the time. What's going on? So that was kind of a cool offshoot. Um, and, and based on that and my voice of doom and everything else, that's another research project is to look up and um, understand how to improve your voice. There was a woman in town that does some kind of voice co coaching and I sent her an email asking her if she would help me and I got no answer. It's like, oh my gosh, you're advertising your thing and you're not even going to answer. So yeah, I, my name is Mud in this town. But that's alright. They didn't know me before and they know me now. I hope you're fitting in fun in everything that you're doing and that you are accomplishing your goals and especially that you have goals. So 
Let's come up with some.